It is a quick replacement. It is a single plug and play application. I'll show you guys how to switch it out and get it fixed up real quick. Hey everybody, welcome back to another Classics or Better. I'm Travis and today we are talking headlight and dimmer switches, my friends. So specifically a 2000 to 06 Silverado, Sierra, Suburban, Tahoe, all the same type thing, right? So the issue I'm dealing with y'all is at night when I'm driving, all of my dash gauges, my radio, all this kind of stuff just start slowly dimming out like you're messing with the switch here. Now sometimes that can be because there's debris and junk in here and you can just rip this thing back and forth really fast and that'll kind of clear it out and it'll work. Didn't really work on mine. Sometimes it'll kind of come back. Sometimes it just goes dark. The good news is that the whole thing is just one unit. It's very affordable. So I have a link below to it, um, but it is a single plug and play application to get it replaced. So I'll show you guys how to get all this junk off of here. We'll snap the new one in and rock and roll. So luckily you don't need a ton of tools, y'all. You just need your replacement unit you're gonna use, your car key so you can get the steering wheel out of the way, and then either a flathead screwdriver or like a putty knife, something like that, to push the little tabs down on the side so you can get the old one out. So step one is gonna be getting this trim off of here so you can actually access the unit. Now your little shift knob here will actually block you from taking this all the way off. So just get your keys, turn it mostly on, shift down a little bit so you can get this thing out of the way and then literally just gently pull all this off it's just hooked on with tabs so you just want to be careful so you don't break anything but it'll just pop right off of here once you get it off just set it off to the side and then this is what we're working on. So you can go ahead and shift back up, turn everything off. Here is the old unit with the trim off. It is just held in by little tabs here on the side. So that's where you end up using your putty knife or a screwdriver just to kind of get in here so you can get this thing pulled out. pop right out when it's out there's just a single plug holding it in so just depress it take it out loose get your new one snap it right in there and boom that is literally the reinstall get your trim snap back on here put your steering wheel back up you're done, my friends. It is that easy. Well, as always, thank you all for watching. I truly appreciate it. If you got some value from this, please do me a favor. Hit that like and subscribe if you can. But get out there, get wrenching, my friends. And I'll see you all on the next one. Yeah.